Hello guys and welcome back to a new episode of Broke Boys. I'm al fresco today. That's not the word. I'm on my vlogging camera because I have a tripod situation at the moment. My vlogging camera, I just thought I would hold and be more relaxed anyway. This is my vlogmas or brokemas. That's weird. My phone is going off. I had to pick a winner of the faux faux coat giveaway. I think some people got a bit confused on Instagram because, okay, in the last episode of Broke Boys, in the video, I had, my shadow's there, I had the picture of that I was posting on Instagram, but then the faux faux coat that I'm giving away is the grey one from ASOS that I got from last year. It's still got tag in it and everything. But I think people for some reason thought that I was giving away the coat on the picture, in the picture on Instagram, which I'm not. My giveaways keep getting messed up, don't they? People just get really confused. Um, I swear they're straightforward. Yeah, I'm gonna pick a winner for the faux faux coat giveaway right now, and then I'm just gonna show you what the current situation is with the stuff that I'm selling. I have a winner of the faux faux coat from from the Instagram competition and there was over 700 entries and this person truly deserved to win because this person has been active on my videos and on my Instagram for I don't even know how long. Um, he's always there for me on Twitter and he was one of the first people to enter this competition so he must have seen the video first and then for commented on Instagram so it just shows that I think he's probably one of my biggest supporters and it is Hubert, you can't see on this phone. It's OVO Hubert is his Instagram name. And like I always say, like I'm like RuPaul in the sense that I get to choose who wins because it's my giveaway. So what I say goes. <sighs> Today's giveaway, I'm not so sure what the pieces will be and I'll show you the reason why. Also, I just got a text off Tom. We're supposed to be going to see Pia Mia tonight and I'm so excited. Also, a quick thought before I move on to the next section. Some people are getting annoyed by the memes in my last few videos. I'll pop up a meme for like a split second because I think it relates to what I'm talking about and I think it's hilarious and a lot of people have found them funny because they've left comments saying they find them funny but then a few comments have been like what is with these subliminal messages? Illuminati and it's like mm, no it's just a meme. Should I leave it up for longer? Is that the problem? <laughs> is it that the meme isn't up for long enough? Um, but yeah no I thought they were funny so I don't know let me know what you think in the comments below. What do you think of the memes? So in, for in terms of affordable things this week, I've been looking at Menace um, because especially in terms for like jackets and winter stuff, because okay, 70 quid, but this is a faux suede and it just looks so nice. Like look at the drop shoulder on those sleeves. It looks like a really nice faux suede material. I wish they had a little video clip on Menace, but they don't. But yeah, it just looks so nice. That's the grey faux suede minimal Okanama jacket and I'll leave a link in the description below. Um, next, I was looking at just this like black high neck signature long sleeve t-shirt for £25. So it has the menace kind of signature thing on the collar. Um, and it just looked really nice and simple. Um, and then this has gone into sales. So it's only 105 now. I know it's still quite expensive, but it is a long wool coat and it looks really nice on. It's like a burgundy black kind of thing. Well, it says burgundy, but it looks like black. Um, and then same again, burgundy. Um, but this is £90. Okay, so this is not this is not as broke as we want to be. This is not as broke as we're seeming. But it's Christmas, you know? Like, you're going to have to loosen the purse strings a tiny bit if you want something. Like, look at this jacket. Love it. Look how it looks really boxy and so big. Um, this is a wool shoulder trucker jacket. So this looks kind of a bit like the Fear of God hoodies. Um, it's only £40. So it's got the contrast. So it's got a black sweatshirt material and then a grey hood. I like that colourway. They've got other colourways of it as well, but I like this one the most. So just a couple of things I was looking at on Menace. Um, I'd love to know what you guys think of Menace as well, because I obviously love it to bits. This is where I keep all the stuff that I'm going to sell um, on Depop. And at the minute, it's just a bit much. So I need to kind of sort it out somehow, divide it up, take pictures of everything, and then put it on Depop. Um, I'm just at the same place that I was like ages ago in the fact that I just have loads and loads of stuff, like too much stuff and it's not good. But yeah, I've ha I have tried to get rid of stuff, I just i have got more stuff. I should be on like an episode of The Hoarders or whatever it's called. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna have a big sort out of it now actually, and a big fold. Also, uh, do you know what I thought might be interesting? Do you want to see my Spotify wrapped? Because I think it's great. I love looking at people's Spotify wrapped. 
So, here's mine. So, in 2017, I've listened to 44,000 minutes of music. My top genre is pop. My top artists are Dua Lipa, Drake, Nicki Minaj, Muramasa and Tara Jr. My top songs are New Rules, Chasing Highs, Stay, Friends and Phases. Mental. So cool. What's yours? I want to know yours. If you use Spotify, if you are subscribed to my Spotify playlist as well, that'd be cool. Hey guys, today is a new day and I feel refreshed. Uh, last night I was feeling, yesterday I was just feeling like demotivated, whereas today I feel like on top of things, which is great. Um, so I've decided to get all the stuff that I'm going to sell in like small piles and take pictures of it for Depop that way. Um, still not decided what I'm going to give away yet, but it'll be something that's in that cupboard. Um, my shameful Monica cupboard. And what was I going to say? Oh yeah, so last night actually we went to see Pia Mia. Um, she's got a collection with In The Style and my friend Sarah has a collection with In The Style as well. Like loads of collections. Um, so the launch event was at a club in London last night so we went to that and that was really really fun. And Pia Mia actually performed. And I'm such a fan, no pun intended, but she is amazing. And she was a great singing live as well so it was awesome. And I just got some Christmas presents from Urban Outfitters delivered which is great. Feeling very on top of Christmas which is good. Uh, I was going to say something else to you as well, but I've forgotten that. I'm sure it'll come back to me at some point. Don't know what it was. Oh yeah, what I was going to say was, I'm obsessed with these Hi-Fi FNK track pants. Literally, just ignore the mess in my room. But yeah, I can't go over these ones. I mean, I love them all. They're all great, but these ones. I need to turn notifications for all my dating apps off because they distract me so much in the day. I'm one of those people as well, like now I've seen PME, I'm literally just going to listen to PME for like a week, probably. So once, when I like, when I went to see Dua Lipa, I was like, just listening to Dua Lipa non-stop. So when I see someone, it makes me want to listen to me even more. Let's do it! Such a first world problem, but this is my job. This is my life. It's real now. So I've officially reached my limit of taking pictures and stuff today. This is all the stuff here. Ta-da! Um, I'm over it. So I'm gonna got all the pictures on my phone. I'm gonna depop them all, so they'll be available on Depop right now. And again, if I don't sell them this week, then they're going to charity. So if there's anything you like, be quick. And if not, that's fine. Um, just trying to make space because. I have no space. I've chosen what I'm going to give for the giveaway as well. So I'm going to give away my Pablo bomber jacket from the Life of Pablo pop-up store that was here in Shoreditch um, in, in East London at the start of the year. I got this for around 200 quid, I think. So I'm just going to give it away because I've not worn it in ages. And I think that it would have a happier life somewhere else. Um, the last giveaways have been really confusing. So for this giveaway, all you have to do is be subscribed to me here on YouTube. You have to leave a comment so that I know that you've entered the giveaway so I know you want to be a part of it. Thumbs up the video and tell a friend about my channel and get them to subscribe. And if you're in your comment you want to be like, I got my mates subscribed, then that's fine. You can like tag them or whatever. Um, just let me know what you've done and why you should deserve to win the Pablo bomber jacket. It's a size large. It's quite oversized. It's a nice, a nice fit. I think I've got a picture of me wearing it from ages ago, which I'll put here or something. And I'll announce that in the next episode of Broke Boys. Don't forget to turn notifications on. Give this a big thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry it's been a bit of a weird video. Just trying to sort out my entire life and purge my wardrobe of stuff that I don't wear and don't need. Hope you have a good rest of your day and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.